All right, boys, welcome back to another video. I was not going to upload a video today, but my God, I was just playing Injustice 2 on my phone. I was playing Arena, and then I went to the homepage, and then I realized that we got a free reward today for the Harley Quinn anniversary. So today is Heartbreaker. I'm sorry, it's Harley Quinn's. Sorry, whenever I say Harley Quinn, I automatically think about Heartbreaker because she's the best Heartbreaker in the game. She's the best character in the game. Look, I just said that. She's the best Harley in the game. All right, whatever. Point is, today is the 30th anniversary of Harley Quinn. Now, like I said, we got free rewards for this incredible anniversary. And these rewards are some of the best rewards I've ever seen. And the best part is they're absolutely 150% free. If you go over to your, uh, to your inbox and you check the rewards, we got one of the greatest profile picks of all time. I mean, look at this, bro. Everybody loves soccer, right? I think it's the biggest sport in the game. This literally looks like a fucking soccer jersey, right? One of the greatest profile picks ever created in this game. Why would I why would I want to use somebody like like Predator and Batman, right? The the, the Hellbat suit. Why would I want to use this absolute god looking character right i mean look at this dude he's got the badass ears he's got the glow he got the drip from head to toe why would i want to use this profile pic when i could just use this basic number 30 profile pic with the harley quinn logo in the number 30 not in the background in the number 30 it is so innovative this is just dude gary gary was in my bed before i started this video he was on top of my bed but he was so excited. Gary was so excited that he literally fell over off of my bed. Gary, stay right there, bro. Stay right there, Gary. He might fall again. He's just so excited about this awesome anniversary. By the way, channel members, spam the Gary emote down in the comments. All right, just saying. But not only this, not only did we get this awesome profile pic, but also in the inbox message, it said that this week, wait for it, wait for it, I know a lot of people have been asking. I know a lot of people have been asking for Multiverse Armored Supergirl and Multiverse The Flash Arena season. But I am so excited to announce that this week we're going to get Batman Ninja Harley Quinn in the Arena season. I know, I know, I know. One of the best characters in the game. We're going to be able to get 360 shards for her if you reach Elite Four. It is incredible. Just awesome. I am so excited to be getting a character given to me as an anniversary gift. A character that I already have at seven stars practically. And not only that, but also 2,000 free shards for her. Extra shards for this character, right? I mean, this character is just so unbelievably good. You don't even need to have her. On your Batman Ninja team for her to affect the Batman Ninja team. All you need is for her to be in your roster. I mean, I mean, just look at this passive, dude. Just by her being in your roster, she gives you 30% more attack. Holy God. Not 30% damage, because that's not how this game fucking works for some reason. 30% attack, which is going to give you like maybe 5% more damage or something. Maybe less. I don't fucking know. This game is weird. Whatever. You know what, bro? I can't even stop pretending. Why... Are we getting these dog shit rewards, man? I mean, look, I know NetherRealm has a really bad track record at giving us free good shit. But at one point, I think there was an anniversary for this character as well, for Harley Quinn. There was something with Harley Quinn. And they were they gave us free shards for her uh, from the arena store. Or I guess they're not free, but you could buy you could have bought shards for her in the arena store for like a week or something like that. See, that was fucking goaded. Because then you could go into the arena store and you could maybe try to get a little bit of extra shards for Harley Quinn. I mean, look at this, dude. Look at this. I've been playing this game for five years. I've been playing this game for five years. I was playing this game before Harley Quinn was good because at one point she got refactored. And I barely have any extra shards for this character, right? Granted, she is already seven stars. I do have 250 extra shards. But again, five years. This is a five-year project right here, okay? Why... Is it so hard for them to just give us some Heartbreaker shards again, right? Last time it was only in this store for a week. If you didn't have any medals, you weren't able to get any of her shards. If you did, if you saved up some of them, you were able to get some of her shards. You could probably, I don't know, pick up like 50 shards for the character. It's it's nothing, but it's better than getting this absolute dog shit character, Batman Ninja Harley Quinn. I know there's going to be some of you that are going to say, Oh, but technically speaking... 
because you don't need to have this character in your roster. And if you have the beta club, whenever you use Batman Ninja, Batman Ninja Catwoman in solo raids, you're going to be able to do 5 million more damage. Okay, if you're somebody who actually thinks like that, who actually thinks that this character is good because you're going to be able to whip out a little bit of extra damage with fucking Batman Ninja Catwoman, keep in mind, Batman Ninja Harley Quinn, I'm sorry, uh, 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 Heartbreaker Harley Quinn is one of the best characters in the whole fucking game, bro. She could do millions and billions of damage if you have Raven billions. If you don't have Raven, she could do hundreds of millions of, uh, of damage. You know what I mean? So why is it so hard for them to give us shards for this character? And even if they did give us free shards for this character, we would still have to try to go get EPI and promote her to make Heartbreaker good. So I don't understand what the problem is right now man nobody is playing this game anymore they gotta step up their game right now right now they gotta step up the game man because you could just tell off the youtube views that this game is just going down pretty quickly bro pretty fucking quickly now look i'm saying they gotta pick up this game not so i can get more views or some shit i don't give a flying fuck i i like this game i like the mechanics if they gave us free shit every week or something like that maybe like 50 shards for a character every single week like look, look, look at my cyborg look at my cyborg look at my cyborg cyborg look at my cyborg playing this game for five years this is one of the first characters that ever came out in the game i don't even have him at seven stars five years later they gotta step up their game homie they gotta step up the fucking game 50 free shards every single week for a random character in your roster they gotta do something like that bro because right now it's just so time consuming to get anywhere in this game and when they give us dog shit anniversaries like these it just makes it even worse it's like a slap it's like a fucking slap across the face at least give us multiverse armored supergirl i know it has nothing to do with harley but fuck everyone would be so much happier this way man they could be fixing champions arena they could be fixing the the the, the league uh, the leagues, whenever you go in leagues and check members, the game always fucking crashes. They could be fixing solo raids. There, there's so many solo raids in the game now. It takes an eternity to get back to another solo raid that you want to fight, right? It's like six months. It's like, it's like four months to get back to the solo raid that you started at. It's so stupid. They got to... They got to start fixing this game, man, because it's going downhill quick. It's so stale right now. No one's even really caring about solo raids right now. There's so many of them. It's not even fun anymore. It's not even like interesting when a new solo raid comes out. The only thing that's interesting is the free artifact that we get from the solo raid. Not even the bosses, just the free artifact. That's the only thing that people are interested in seeing. So imagine if they gave us free shards every single week for characters. On top of giving us the, the league raid shards whenever you defeat raids. Because even if you do... Alright. I guess even even Gary. Gary is so mad right now. He literally jumped. He, Gary tried to commit die right now by jumping off my bed. I know. I know. I'm mad. I'm mad too. I'm mad too. He's mad. I'm mad. He tried to commit die by jumping off the cliff. My bed. But, I mean, come on, dude. They, they, they got to step it up, man. Because even those, even those free rewards that we get off of league raids, it's just not enough. I mean, look. It's a Harley Quinn anniversary. Nothing's even $10 off. Even though, even though they're the fucking gear packs, you know? If they would have given us maybe even legendary Harley Quinn shards, it would have been better. Because at least it's a fucking legendary, right? Batman and Harley Quinn is so garbage. And she's she, she's good, but she's also one of the easiest characters to get. So why would we want her for the for for, for, for the for the anniversary, you know? G give us something else. I don't know, man. This game gets me so frustrated sometimes. I don't even know what to say, bro. But it's so stupid. If, if You know what? Channel members, channel members, uh, a couple days ago, uh, this guy named Dale donated a bunch of channel members. So if, if you if you see that your name is green on my channel, that means that you got gifted a channel membership. So channel members right now, everybody spam the fucking clown emote because NetherRealm is a bunch of clowns, man. This is, this is every time I, list, I hear about NetherRealm, this is what I think about. Every time I think about another room, this is what I think about right here, man. Because I feel like they always have a good opportunity to come back and do something good. Even if it's just something mid, it's better than what they've given us right now. Because everything is so dog shit right now. I would even take mid, bro. This is this is, this is is another room right now, man. I'm so mad right now. It's so fucking stupid. I was going to stream later today. I don't even... I, you know what? In honor of the anniversary, I think I'm not even going to stream Injustice. Straight up. I think I'm not even going to stream Injustice. Just... Just... 
just because of this. I'm so mad about this. I'm so mad about how stupid this is. Even in my secondary account where I have my tier eight leagues, I'm, I'm playing the game, you know, not every single day, super hardcore, but I'm playing the game and, and I'm still, I feel like I'm not even really getting anywhere in that account. You know, this would have helped me out a lot. This would have helped me out a lot of my secondary account. It would have helped out a lot of you guys as well on your main accounts. Cause I know a lot of you guys don't spend money on the game or again, this is something a lot of people don't take into consideration. Everyone's always saying, Oh, well, I have a lot of heartbreaker shards because I bought a lot of chests and I got lucky or whatever. Yeah, but you are grinding the game all day long and you also got lucky to get those shards, you know? They got to start thinking about the average player, the person that's not playing this game fucking five hours a day, right? They got to they gotta pump their brakes now because getting characters to seven stars takes too long. Unlocking some characters takes way too long. I'm never going to unlock Cyborg in my secondary account. It's not going to happen. Never, ever, 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 ever. Because in five years, I don't even have extra shards for the man right now, you know, in my main account. In my secondary account, it's not going to happen. They got to stop being so goddamn greedy. I don't know what is going through their minds right now, but they really got to step up their game. Because this game is really quickly going downhill. And it's not even going downhill because they continue to do bad stuff. Because everybody already knows that they always do bad stuff. It's more like the game is so stale. And there's nothing good coming out that they can't even attract new players. So, like, just slowly over time. Just going to go like that. Slowly over time. One player a day at a time. It's just going to be going down like that. I, I, I really don't think there's any new people any new people playing the game right now. It's so stupid, man. But either way, whatever. It is what it is. Gary, I know you're mad, baby. Oh, look, Gary fell again. My motherfucker is so mad he's falling everywhere, man. I hope you guys have a good day. Stay safe and stay clean. I know this video was be me just crying about shit, but it's... Just, I like the game. I like the mechanics. I want the game to succeed. I want it to be good, but... They just let me down. They let me down every single time. I know I'm just crying about shit right now, but they just let me down every single time, and I hate that. I hate that because I know what the people want. I wish they would put me as, like, the head of the fucking community manager shit. Because even if I got, even if I didn't get paid for that shit, I would do it. Just because I know what the community wants. I know what the community wants, man. I would do it for free. Netherrealm, if you're watching this right now, bro. If you guys need a community manager. Because the one you guys got right now was dog shit. You gotta get me. You gotta get me. Because I know exactly what the players want. I know exactly what the players want, man. I can bring this game. I, I'm, I'm your fucking quick revive. I'm your quick revive from zombies, right? I could bring this game back to prime like this, baby. Just like this, because I know what I'm doing. I'll do it for free. Just got to send me an email, you fucks. Anyways, see you guys later. Have a good day. Keep it thick.